Welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is Golly, and you are watching some Call of Duty World of War custom zombie gameplay on the PC. Today I'm playing the map UGX Calmo C version 1.1, and uh, I downloaded this map off of the website zombiemodding.com, and that's actually where I download all of these custom maps you'll see me playing up on my channel on Call of Duty World of War, because people like you and me that just play this game for fun take the time out of their day to make insanely awesome maps like these and the mapping and coding for these are ridiculously hard so uh i can only imagine how long making one of these would actually take i know i can't uh yet anyway try to do that i mean actually i, I don't know i feel like i could it would just take a long time to learn the program and uh, the reason that there are modded maps on this game and not like Black Ops and Black Ops 2 Zombies is because the modding tool that was released to make these maps in the first place was only released for World of War and Treyarch never actually released the dev tool to make zombie maps for Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2. So making custom maps on those games is impossible unfortunately, which kind of sucks, but at least they make them on World of War. And they can add things into these maps from other Call of Duty games. Like, uh, as you can see, the gun I have right now is from Call of Duty 4, which is pretty cool. And then the G3. I don't know what I want. I think I'm going to save up some points. And hopefully buy the gun that's behind this door. Actually, what? There's, there's no way. There's no way I survived that. I'm sorry. I ain't taking any risks. This is for YouTubes. Some YouTube gameplay. That's what I'm uh, going for right now. Just because I'm trying to upload one video every day. And I know I didn't get around to doing that today. Because I've been busy. It's a nice day, nice summer day. And I've been outside most of the day swimming and uh, uh, playing some basketball. And it was fun. Max Hammer. But. I'm trying to upload one video every day in the month of July, so you should be expecting a lot more videos up on my channel here in this month. So for all you Golly fans that have missed content from me lately, this month is is go time, alright? So the only problem is I'm going to be gone for a week of it on vacation, but that's okay because I'm going to try to go hard this week and try to get a lot of videos made so I'll at least have one video every day to put up on my channel while I'm gone so you guys will still see videos from me and all I just won't be live streaming like I normally am but uh, I think the mystery yep the mystery box is right in there and that's what I'm gonna go ahead and open <gasps> Power! yes come on thunder gun thunder gun what desert eagles oh my god it's silver Nice. This is awesome. I never got this gun on this map. Ah. I might sound like I have a stuffed up nose, guys. I don't know. I feel like I do. But. Who knows. Might just be because I'm really tired. I'm going hard at basketball today. It was really hot out. Insanely hot. 1500 for that garage. Actually, I've never opened that garage door up wonder what's inside. I'll have to find out this game, guys. I'm going to try to open up everything on this map and uh, complete the objectives, as you can see. I have to gain access to the main building, which is targeted on my map way over here. So I have to open up this middle building, and I think the door for it is four grand. Yep, 4,000. So I really don't feel like buying that right now. I'm trying to save up for some juggernaut, because round four, no juggernaut. Can't be happening. At least I have quick revive and a rape desert eagle. One hit. Pop, 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 pop. Pack a punch. Pack a punch. All right, found that. I think it spawns at the same spot every time. So, anyways, this is my first game of zombies on the PC this week. Um, actually. Yeah, it is, because I didn't play on Monday. And then on Tuesday, the new map pack came out on Black Ops 2 on the Xbox. 
So there really hasn't been a point for me to play uh, PC lately since most of the new zombies are on Xbox. And uh, I've been having a lot of fun with that map. But you know, I can't just kill myself out on that map. Or burn myself out on that map. You know what I'm saying. So I figured I'd just go ahead and play a different zombie map for once. And look at that, the USAS-12. Oh my god, that's a Black Ops 2 gun. That's awesome. No, 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 no. Black Ops 1 gun. My bad. My bad. You know what I mean. Whoa. This thing has a, some... This thing has some firepower. I like it. Oh, I know where Juggernaut is. Juggernaut is inside the room for 4,000. So that's gonna suck. I have to open up the 4,000 point door to get Juggernaut. It's 2,500. You know what? I wish this was buried so I could just take money out of my savings. And we'd all be good. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but if you've been going hard on buried like I have, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have money in the bank, so... Usually what I would be doing up on buried <laughs> is uh, go to the bank at the beginning of every round. and I mean, at the beginning on round one. And then withdraw like 20 grand, open up a crap load of doors, get some perks, and then have a jolly old time. And that's usually how I like to play that map. Because I was running a rave train up until round like 31 one time, and every round I was putting money into the bank. So I definitely at least have like 100 grand in my uh, bank account on the freaking buried map it's pretty awesome so anytime I go on that map I just take out 20 grand and have a little fun <laughs> and I, I hate when you get money out of the bag on that map and then you go down oh my god that's ridiculous yes please now I'm gonna have enough for jug and this door hopefully if I kill some zombies with this insta kill Nice. Nice. Full deagle ammo. That's a bad spot to be. It's too tight of a corner. Calero! Alright, time to open this door. Activate the log cutting saw trap in the main building. Okay. How much is that? Two grand! <laughs> no. I need that first, and I don't even have enough for that yet, so... We're gonna have to wait a minute, folks. It's round seven. I'm getting sketched out. I need a new gun. She won't cut it. Come on, something good. UMP. UMP. Alright, I need to get out of here. Oh my god, mystery box. You're almost to the death of me. Okay, now this spot back here is probably the best camping spot on this map. Um, at least for higher rounds, solo, if you have all the perks and stuff. And you can hold out here. It's really nice. I was camping here before. And this is really the only good spot I can find on this map, honestly. Look at all them goodies. Nice. I'm gonna go grab that. Sweet. Juggernaut. Let's go. Let's go. There is a chance. Alright. Now we got some security up in here. Next round, I'm gonna have to be buying Sleight of Hand and the Mystery Box a few times. Get me a point whore gun. There's some pretty dope guns on this map, so I'm trying to hit the mystery box a lot to show you guys some of the cool guns that are on here. Because I don't even know all the guns that are on here. And uh, that needs to change. And especially if viewers want to see all the cool maps. I mean, all the cool guns on this map. That That's even more of a reason to try the mystery box more. Die! Oh god. 
That water freaking kills you, I swear. It's ridiculous. It was injuring me, at least. I thought so. Okay, let's zombie. Time to go hit the mystery box. Let's go. Actually, hold on. If I do remember correctly, there's like another part of the map back here. Oh, never mind. I don't get the wrench until... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait a second. Can I get this wrench? XM. XM8. What? Oh my god. LMG basically for two grand. I'll take that any day of the week. Um, I thought there was more to the map, but apparently I don't have enough for you. Dang it! 2500 for that. Not this round. Not this round. Okay, so I guess for this round, I'm just gonna try to get sleight of hand opened up. So I'm gonna buy the first circuit. And then next round, whenever I have enough, I can open up that door for a thousand. And then buy Sleight of Hand, which is located right behind that door. Until then, let the zombie slaying begin. This XM80 is going to look sick upgraded. I can't wait to do it. Pack a punch. Here we come. No, 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 no. I fell in the water. Whew. That was a close one. So I wanted to ask my viewers what their favorite summertime meal is, all right? Because mine is steak and potatoes, um, especially with A1 sauce. And you gotta make sure you have some butter up on those potatoes. That just makes it so much better. So yeah, make sure you comment on this video what your favorite summertime meal is and like maybe how often you eat it. How, how fat you feel afterwards I don't know whatever floats your boat just comment I'll look at it check it out comment back most likely I love reading my comments it brightens my day seeing some of the things people leave me it's, it's really awesome doing what I do here on YouTube and uh, my subscribers make it so much fun for me with all the support you guys show me it's insane so we're going to go ahead and Oh, I slide of hand here. Speed cola! Three perks, and I think the next perk on the map that I can buy is double tap. But I'm gonna try to see if I can find a mule kick or something. I'm not sure if I've explored the entire map yet, so as soon as I have enough points, I'm gonna just go ham it open indoors and stuff. And then hopefully I'll find a new area. If not a whale. Still a pretty cool map, and you guys will get to see it all. Bada bing, bada boom. Until then, we camping on the bridge. Just funneling them zombies in here. Oh, yeah. See, this is why I definitely need a slice hand. This would be impossible without it at higher rounds. Trust me. Yes. Yes. Look at how many points I have right now. I can pack a punch. Sweet. Nice. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and pack punch this thing. See how lethal it is. Let's go. Nice. It's like freaking blue. And look at this. I'm gonna activate the saws. Objective complete. And then it activates these saws on the map. And they will actually kill zombies and stuff. But I'm not trying to be trapped in there. I'm not trying to watch that. I'm trying to get back to my camping spot because it is round 11. Zombies will swarm me if I stay in there. So it's basically a four shot right now. 500 bullet magazine with at least like a 30 bullet clip. So this gun's pretty good. Oh yeah. Best combo. I like the camo they put on this gun too. You on the wrong 
Treyarch needs to step up their game, son. They don't got nothing on these PC mods. None really in there. Okay, so I can camp up here for another round. And then go open some stuff up. What's the next part of the objective? Find the pipe wrench in the illum illuminated toolbox. Oh, I know where that is. I've actually done some of these steps before, guys. I just haven't actually completed the j objective for this map to the entire ending. But I do know where the illuminated toolbox is. So at the end of this round, I'm going to try to leave a crawler and go find that. And hopefully, it'll let me pick up the pipe wrench like it did last time. I don't want to spoil that, but you guys will see that soon. Best believe. Alright, we're coming near the end of this round. Time to chuck a nade. Nice. We have a crawler. Alright, let's get to work. Open some does up. Alright, this is the part of the map back here that I haven't explored. Pipe wrench is not there. Okay, so that means it could only be one other place. Which is back here. Can't open that. And open that. Hello, teddy bear. Yep, here we are. That's the toolbox, but it's not illuminating for some reason. Hmm. In an illuminated toolbox. Well, I'm pressing F on it. Nothing's happening. So I'm guessing I didn't uh, do a part of the objective yet, apparently. Oh well, no pipe wrench this time. That's a bummer. So basically what the pipe wrench was, was it's like a, an equipment you can pull out and then you can knife zombies with it. And it was like a one hit up until round 18 or something. It was pretty cool. And I wanted to show you guys that, but I, I'm not sure if I'm actually going to be able to get at this game or not. So we're going to go back over to the mystery box and try to get something better than the UMP45. And hopefully I still have enough to pack a punch after hitting the box a few times. So let's try this. Let's go. Yeah. I can get something better. Trust me. There are plenty better guns in this box. Limbs are gonna fly. Ah, come on. Nice, M60. You know what? Pfft. Screw it, let's try it again. Nope. We're sticking with the M60. I'm about to point whore it up with this thing real quick. Just because I can. And uh, the reload time actually isn't that bad on it since I have slide of van. So this would actually work for this round set that I'm at right now. Not a bad gun to have at all. It's gonna rack up the points like nothing. Ah, this is nice. Round 13. I, I'm not sure exactly how far we are into this minute wise, but I'm thinking pretty far. Oh golly, time to reload. Zombies are coming. Nuke. That's not good. Holy cow. Did you see that? That zombie like pushed me up almost off the map. That was crazy. Ah, oh, Going for that nuke almost got me down. That would have been shitty. Okay, uh, I'm gonna hit the escape button really quick. Okay, so I was just checking to see if my audio recording was still going or not. And we're right back at it, round 14. 
Let's do it. Let's go, zombies. Now my goal is to not let them trap me up into this corner like they did last time. Because if so, I think I'm going to fall into this uh, radioactive water, which is the last thing that I want to do at this point. My goal right now is round 20, but we're going to see. Because the furthest I made it to is round 18, and then I failed. So, yeah. Going to try to try to step up my game some. See if I can make it higher than what my uh, previous best was on this map. So guys, I think I'm going to start doing uh, more open lobbies. I think you guys will like that. And I'll most likely be live streaming these open lobbies. And the games that I'll be on are mostly like Call of Duty on uh, Xbox, Call of Duty on the PC. I'll be doing like open lobbies on uh, on freaking <laughs> basically any game I can get my hands on. PC games included. And if you wanna if you wanna play with me on Steam and be in my videos on the PC, like on Call of Duty 4, when I need more players in a server for a video, or if I'm just straight up playing in a server, I'll post Steam uh, Steam events for my Steam group. And then you guys can go ahead and join my game. It'll have the IP for the server that I'm on listed right there. So in the description of my PC gaming videos, you should find the link to my my Steam fan group page. And all you gotta do is sign into your Steam account and then hit join group. And then anytime that uh, I set up a Steam game, it'll pop up in the bottom right hand corner of your computer if you're signed into Steam. So there you go guys, that's uh, it's a really easy way to play with Calais. And another easy way is to just follow me on Twitter. Because that's probably... Um, what I post on the most for if I need more players for a game lobby like on Call of Duty like yo I need four more people to love my lobby on Black Ops 2 hit me up my gamer tag's essential and then it'll be something like that and you guys can join my game from that tweet and look at that we're on round 16 two light machine guns pack a punch my little friend is what this gun's called. That's awesome. I didn't even see that until right now. So I gotta start getting a little bit smarter with how I'm dealing with these hordes of zombies coming at me. Because I'm getting kind of lazy with it. Not timing my reloads great. And if I'm gonna be in this camping spot for too long, I'm definitely gonna have to watch this. Because this can be really dangerous if I back myself up in the corner too much. Oh, never mind. Not this second, at least. Pew, pew. Like I have a ray gun. Boom. So honestly, I think I can keep doing this LMG thing for a couple more rounds. Rack up my points some. Try to get the best guns I can from the mystery box. And then maybe run a rape train somewhere else on the map whenever this gets too hard to hold up. I think in a round or two I might buy double tap, but for right now, I think not having double tap is actually saving me some ammo. Which is good. Some more ammo equals more points. The mo zombies dead. Let's go zombies! Die! Whoa. There are a crap ton of them coming right now. I like how quick this LMG reloads. Oh my gosh. This one still rapes. This one's definitely better than the... Than the freaking... Uh, M60 up upgraded. I think that might be the last one. The last two. They're about to be crawlers, and I'm about to hit the box a few times. Or not. What the hell? There we go.
Okay, so let's see what's in this shed. M60 ammo. <laughs> nice. So I actually found viable wall ammo for both of the LMGs that I have right now. And actually, I've never been in this area. Stem techs. I like my frags. They make me crawlers. No, thank you. And we have some more rooms that I haven't seen yet. Not really much to this area, except the mystery box spawn. Hmm. Well, that's cool. Finding out stuff that I didn't see before. Sweet. Okay. We're going back into the main map. And, uh, we're going to go over here and hit the mystery box. There are the, the blades that maybe you didn't get a chance to see earlier. They actually kill zombies, but... You know what? I don't know how to like run a rape train in here to actually use them. Like, would I wait like that and then run a train and let the blades kill my train? I feel like these walls would fuck me over. I, I don't know. I feel like it's too risky to actually try. All right, mystery box town. Hmm. Should have figured. Shit. Where'd it go? Double tap, double tap, double tap. Nice. See if I can double pack a punch. Why you know? That would be so sweet. It'd turn into like an orange camo. That'd be nice. Okay, so box is back behind this area of the map. Oh, there you are. Nice. Oh, shoot. I actually got this gun on one of my other videos. So you guys have seen this before if you watch my custom zombie vids. It's not that good. It's just a submachine gun. I'll pass it up. I'm trying to get something a little bit better. What is this? Oh, the Stoner 63 from Black Ops. Sweet. Not the gun of choice, though. Yeah, MP5 from COD4. No, thank you. Come on, mystery box. AK from Black Ops. No, this is the COD4 AK. Nice. Crossbow. What? Uzi. Come on, box. You can give me something better than that. Ray gun, please. I just saw Thunder Gun, yo. That's what I need. Thunder Gun, give me that. No! Fox Troll. Damn thing just vanished. You know what? Upgrading the AK would be pretty cool. I think I'm gonna do that. Give me a nice little camo. And then rape some zombies bitches with it. Let's go. Yeah, I can come back to the box next round. Let's go. Oh, yellow camo. It's called Osama. It's such a terrorist gun. It's ridiculous. I love it. Every time I see an AK-47, I think of an RPG. Just because, I don't know. I feel like they go well together. And this gun is Kavi Osama. I'm surprised it doesn't have a beard on it. Oh, nice. Max ammo. I'll just spray for a bit. You know. Trollolo some zombies. You can't get me. I have a wall of bullets coming at your face. Trollolololol. -lo -lo -lo. Give me that. This is deadly with double tap. Burns through ammo quite quick, though. But then again, what gun doesn't when this many zombies are coming directly at you in one line? This is an easy spot, but 
I can be overrun really, really easily here. Luckily, I have pack punch guns. Probably wouldn't be able to do without it. Nice. Max ammo and insta kill. That's the perfect way to start next round. All right, I'm gonna wait till the last second to grab those two, because insta kill is good at the beginning of a round. Here we go. Go go go! Back to my camping. Pop. That's another thing I like about PC gaming, guys, the accuracy. You have so much better accuracy on PC because you're using a mouse to aim. I mean, for the first two weeks, I will have to say, it might have been a bit difficult to get used to. But uh, after a while and, and getting used to it, your accuracy will improve tenfold. That's why when people have asked me in past videos about like using an Xbox controller on PC if that's a good idea or not I tell them no because you want that accuracy boost trust me you do might be a bit of a learning curve but it's worth it definitely worth it okay so the game must want me to go to round 20 and there we go round 20 folks yes New high round on this map, sweet. And unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be able to find the pipe wrench in the illuminated toolbox. Because the toolbox isn't illuminating. It wants to be like that. So you guys won't get to see the objective like I told you you might get to see earlier in this video. I'm sorry, but uh, this game wants to troll me. And not illuminate the toolbox like what the hell. And the Osama is just putting in work right now. As you can see, I'm kind of spraying and praying since uh, I have a nice little max ammo in front of the face. That I might not get. Nice! Oh my god, I almost got down. But luckily, the nuke saved my ass just in time. That would have been bad, going down on round 20. Not something I want to do. Actually, I can buy ammo for the AK too. Uh, if I go straight down this hallway, there should be ammo on the wall. And then if I go around the corner, I'll have ammo for my other gun. That's crazy. Round 21. Incoming. I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to camp here for, but hey, well, it seems to be working, so it's whatever. Like Alright, so I see two of the best power-up combo in the game. Trying to get that. Nice. Max ammo, AK time. And I get a max. This is too perfect. Die. Nice. I have a shit ton of points. 20,000. 40. 42,000. What am I thinking? And this is exactly what I was trying to do. Get a lot of points. That way I can spam the mystery box and get the ray gun and the thunder gun and pack a punch both of them. Come this way, zombies. So this is probably my last round of uh, using these guns to camp here. Actually, I don't know. It seems to be still working. <laughs> I don't know if I quite want to quit this strategy yet. It's really nice. 
I haven't even been using my XM8, which I know for a fact is probably stronger than the AK. Boom. Sweet. Fifty one thousand. Grenade time. Crawlers are us. That's how we do. Might be last zombie. Might be last three. Might have to make crawler. I think so. Maybe maybe another grenade will convince them to give up their legs. Or a third, you know. Any day now. What the hell, zombies? No, no more grenades. That's just great. So I'm going to have to live with them. Hmm. Well, that's just something, isn't it? Mystery box. Come on, help a brother out. Oh, that was stupid. Oh well. You know what? That was a fail. I need something good. AK, come on, I just traded you in. You failed me, box. Oh my god. No, come on. I can't be repping this gun. I need I need a crawler. Come on. I don't know what I'm going to do, guys. I need a crawler at round 23. And to do that, I think you need a lot of grenades. Which I don't have. I should have actually sprayed my gun a bit before I grabbed that, but oh well. Nice. What? Nuke nukes on nukes on nukes. Jeez. Yo, I'm about to change my Turtle Beach batteries because I've been going hard apparently and I've been running through batteries like crazy. So, uh, yeah, just put new batteries in my Turtle Beach right now. And there we go. Batteries installed. Back to zombie slaying. Ha! <laughs> M48 3 spam. You know what, some of you guys will probably want to see gameplay of this, Pack-a-Punch. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Because I can. Maybe. Whoo! That's not healthy. Oh my god. See, this is what I mean. I really don't know where I'm going to be running a train on this map at. Alright, that was too close. Oh my god! ACOG! This looks sweet. Oh, that is nice. I hope it actually does some damage on round 24. We better. <laughs> this thing looks sick though, not going to lie. I wasn't expecting the ACOG. Oh! Get the- What? Did it just spawn somebody? Hey, I'll protect you. Yo, this- What? What? No AI versus AI accuracy graph for weapons, stem techs? What kind of troll is that? Apparently- that gun just lagged me out of my match and I got trolled. So that was that was UGX Cosmos, you guys. I hope you got a good glance at it because that was that was my video for today. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, remember to rate it and subscribe to my channel for more fails in zombies. And until next time, peace!